All right, everybody out there. Tonight, I'm gonna interview some various young men and women. Uh, these are some talented people from New York, and I'm always interested in the young, new, talented people who haven't been discovered. Uh, as a prince, uh, I think the best thing you can do is try to help others through, uh, you know, innovative thinking. And the way that I think is that you pull the kids off the street and they give you all the good information that you need. And that's that. So uh, I got a computer guy, I got some production guys, you know, I got some girls who do photography, you know, I got a crew. And they're all good people and they're all part of my royal family. So stay tuned and enjoy the show. Talk to you in a minute. There, it's your favorite prince, Prince Punch and Pat, Beyond Control TV. Uh, I'm here in Marcus Garvey Park, Harlem, New York City. Uh, as you guys know, we're New Yorkers. And I have a very, very special New Yorker with me today, a uh, young man by the name of Brian Berger. He is one of the top graphic designers in the world. Uh, this guy is the bomb. So basically, I want you guys to know about him. I want you to know what he's up to. Uh, and I want you to know that Valley Stream, Long Island should be proud to have Brian Berger as their graphic designer, who is the best in the planet. Go ahead, tell them who you are. I appreciate it, I appreciate it. I'm Brian Berger, like you said. Uh, it's with a Y, not an I. BrianBerger.com. Uh, I come from Valley Stream, lived there all my life, went down to Florida, tried to start something new, tried to get my, my creative juices flowing. I was always interested in the art and computers, put the two together, came up with uh, some good ideas, entered an uh, international designer uh, uh, competition, ended up getting first place out of uh, roughly uh, 3,500 students worldwide. Now hold on, what was the name of the competition? It's the, uh, the, the International Adobe Designer Achievement Awards, 2009. And where was uh, the competition held? The competition was in Beijing, China. Ha! They, wait a minute, uh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Thank this you. guy went to China and beat everybody in some old computer stuff, including the Chinese. They finish up. <laughs> so they, uh, they put me up in a hotel there. I was there for about eight days. There was a whole ceremony. Uh, they ended up giving me a trophy, uh, an award, uh, a check for three grand. Uh, cashed that about last week. Three grand. So, <laughs> was, uh, we'll be getting you more than that, boy. Yeah. We'll be getting you a lot more than that. Uh, by the way, I just want you guys to know that we already have this guy. He's come to Nigeria and he's gonna help us with our technology out there. Um, he's not exclusive, so you guys can call him and get him, get him all the contracts you want. You know, we want this guy to spread the love around the world. What college did you go to? I went to Full Sail University in, uh, in Winter Park, Florida. And what'd you get your degree in? And I got a Bachelor's of Science, which is a web design and computer development uh, degree encompasses design elements like uh, traditional graphic design, interface design, and also bridges the gap between technology and uh, uh, computer technology, web technologies, uh, mobile device technology, uh, yeah, pretty much the whole gamut. You see, this guy, this guy is going to be part of my royal court. Huh? He's going to be Sir Lancelot, Sir handsome Lancelot. and smart. <laughs> All right, can you fight? I can fight. Ah, I can fight too. <laughs> All right, so uh, black belt. he's a black belt, <laughs> you know, you understand? So what we're trying to tell you is that I got all these young guys and they're part of the International Royal Court and, you know, they gave this guy three grand. They sent him to China, put him in a hotel room. This guy's worth three million dollars and better. He's probably going to be worth 300 million. So I just want you people out there to know that Brian Berger is New York's finest Better yet, he is the world's finest graphic designer. And uh, if you guys want to get in touch with him, go to Punch and Pat TV and call the number 212-591-0680 and uh, leave a message for Brian Berger. And uh, make sure you have your money right because we're not charging you $3,000. We're charging you a lot more than that for this young man, okay? So thank you for joining us. Uh, do me a favor, tell them something you want the world to know before we let you go. Uh, I just, all right. Uh, how about uh, design? I do design. I'm a designer. It's not just about selling the products. It's more about the inspiration you give other people, making other people's dreams come true. And uh, that's what I'm all about and that's what I do. So you drop me a line, like you said at the number there, or you can go to www.brianberger.com 
B-R-Y-A-N-B-E-R-G-E-R.com. You can uh, look at my work up there. I got print materials, web. I uh, got everything up there. You can contact me up there and everything. So appreciate it. Thank you. By the way, ladies, he's royalty. He's a knight. Okay, he's royalty, and he's single, and he's good-looking, so do me a favor, Facebookers, get your money right. I'll see you later. What's up, everybody out there? Prince Punching Pad TV. Here we are in Marcus Garvey Park, Harlem, New York City. I'm with my production crew, my boys, the Purple Pumpkins. Um, these guys are, you know, New York boys. They live upstate, they live in the Bronx, they're in the city, and what we do is we move around doing production. I've got various clips on my uh, YouTube channel and you might have seen this guy going around with me from here to LA to, to Toronto, Canada. So uh, what we did is we went and got some of his boys. So what we're going to do is we're going to let them introduce themselves to you. And as I said before, they're the Purple Pumpkins. And if you notice, purple is a royal color and they're keeping it in the family. That was their name before they even met me. So, God works in mysterious ways. Do me a favor. Let the world know who you are and what you're up to. Grab What's up, the world? What's going on? Shouts out there. It's Victor, president of Purple Pumpkins Productions. I've been a bunch of fat for about a while, and uh, it's been a crazy ride. Back and forth. So, uh, it's, been, it's been stunning. It's been stunning time. Let me ask you something. <laughs> <laughs> now that you've been hanging out with us, yeah. what is it? that you've decided to take on when it comes to Punch and Pat Productions? What's your main focus and what do you do for the team? Well, when I first started, um, it was, uh, I didn't know what to do. I didn't know what to expect. You know, you just picked me up out of the blue like that. So uh, it put me in a position where I had to overshadow other workers that he had, other assistants that he had, because this man comes with more than just one assistant. So uh, basically I had to fight my way to the top. I had to show this man that, um, that I belong here. You know, we went out to LA. I never been to LA in my life, and uh, I pulled some strings. Wind up getting this man a VIP table, and uh, he just started taking notice. You know what I could do. You know, we started going everywhere, all over the country. You know, booking him reservations, renting his hotel, driving the car. They do very good public relations work. But if the world was gonna call you right now, what would you want them to call you to do? What kind of work? You want to be a, a, a cameraman? You want to be a sound man? You want to be a a stagehand, what is it that you want the world to know that you do? Well, I like to do pretty much everything, but I have a passion for the camera, for the film. It's more than just the shooting, it's more like capturing the moment. So I gotta say, uh, my passion definitely lies with uh, the camera. Absolutely. All right, so for all you independent production people out there, um, you know, Victor is a budding cameraman, all right? Uh, these are the type of things I want you guys to take note of. People have passions and desires. Let me ask you something. Tell them your name, tell them what you're into, and what you like to work on. Uh, my name is Marshall. Basically, I like to do basketball, but you know, I put up my good friend Victor, and he talks about Pat all the time, so I like to meet him, and finally got the chance to meet him, and now he's teaching me one of how sound, so I like to do sound. There you go. So he's going to be my sound man. And as you can see, he looks like a sound guy, <laughs> right? Let's talk to my man over here. Hey, what's good to you, man? My name is Austin. I'm going to go to the New Bird, Upstate, Purple Pumpkins Productions. As well as the sound system I got going on here, man. I like that one, man. Basically, I want to be a, I'm gonna be a light guy. I'm going to shine a light on you and make sure you like me. There you go. There you go gonna shine the light on you and make you feel like a movie star that's what it's about it's about making people feel good like he said you know capturing the moment you know he wants people to know what it sounds like you know it's on I got the the, the whole thing on lock so please stay tuned look for the purple pumpkins uh, and that's it I will be seeing you guys shortly and uh, ciao for now